Guys, it's Jeff Chan from MMA Fitted, and I'm here with OG Coach Crew Devin Henry. He's here for a good old sparring session. If you like this video, please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. So Crew Devin is an old coach of mine, and I give him the credit for being one of the biggest influence in my current fighting style. I've learned a lot from him, not only techniques but concepts. I used to have a very traditional Muay Thai style. I used to just shell up with every punch thrown, and I used to check every kick thrown at me. After some time training under Crew Devon, I became much more evasive. Now I really enjoy using head movement and dodging to make my opponents miss instead of blocking and feeling the impact of my opponent's strikes. He taught me to play the game of inches, move just enough to dodge and fire back. Here is a nice block from Crew Devon, followed by a sweep by kicking out my standing leg. Another thing I learned from Crew Devon is that since we are competing in MMA, our punches don't need to be thrown with full power on every shot. You can do a lot of damage wearing these little MMA gloves, even if you are not punching with full power, as long as they are clean and accurate. With that said, he taught me to hit and move, throw single strikes with speed and accuracy, then anticipate the counter and get out of the way and repeat. If you tag your opponent and the opportunity presents itself, then you should go for the finish with a multiple punch combination. But if you always go for a big combination every time, not only will you gas yourself sooner, but you'll also leave yourself open more often to be encountered. Another high kick block from Crew Devin, except this time he flared his elbow to buy him some time to kick out my standing leg. I also really grasped the concept of hitting back immediately after you get hit. As you can see, that's why our exchanges are so back and forth. If you are unable to defend an attack, don't let your opponent get away with it and answer right back to even out the score. A spinning back fist lands for me, but Devin fires back, sweeping my leg. Here's a really nice counter the counter by Devin. He throws his jab and I dodge the counter. Then he dodges my punch and simultaneously catches me in the body. This probably would have been a KO, perfectly timed a long knee by Devin. And another nice long knee that would have done some real damage. And finally, something good lands for me. A left high kick. Now if you land one high kick, go for another one while it's hot.
And Devin lands another long knee that probably would have resulted in a KO. Here's another spinning back fist. For those who follow my content closely, you must have noticed that I've been using more spinning attacks. It's because I've gotten many requests from you guys to do more spinning stuff, so here I am trying. Time. Oh, yeah. 